I'm Maya Jama and I'm on a voyage of discovery. Ahead of the 2014 FIFA World Cup, official partner Hyundai is sending me across Brazil. They've given me just 32 days, the duration of the tournament itself, to visit all 12 match cities, soaking up the culture and to discover just why Brazilians are so in love with the beautiful game. It's the journey of a lifetime and you are coming with me. So I've just left Rio and come to Sao Paulo, the biggest city in Brazil. It's exciting, I'm gonna lap up the culture, the vibe, the football, the food, and everything about it. Bring it on. So apparently Sao Paulo has the biggest fleet of helicopters in the world. And I wanna see the stadium, so where better to go than in the air? There's a little problem though, but I can't speak Portuguese, but it's okay, because I've got this. Hello. Você tem um helicóptero? Where? Anywhere. Helicóptero. Posso pegar uma carona no seu helicóptero? This is supposed to be the city where there's loads of helicopters, no? Do you have a helicopter? No one. There's no helicopters anywhere. So I've had no luck on the streets, no one knew where to go, there was no signs, nothing. But my driver knows exactly where I can find a helicopter. So I'm going on a helicopter! <laughs> So I'm really excited. I've managed to hustle my way onto the Sao Paulo training ground. Hopefully going to meet some footballers, get some interaction with players like Pato, Fabiano. It's all quite FBI secretive. We had to sign in to get in. They've got massive gates. Really, obviously, they've got loads of fans and that would love to be here. But I'm the lucky lass. I'm finding my way in. The girls loves is Pato. Yeah, it's eleven. Yeah. Why do you, Why do you think um, Brazilians are so passionate about football? I think we, we have like uh, a lot of problems in Brazil, and then it's the time that everybody forgets. It's like something that you can talk in the bar and don't think about your life and mm -hmm. what are the problems that you have and the problems that you have, you can see in the newspapers. Like everybody loves because of this. Yeah. I think so. And obviously the World Cup's coming to Brazil. Are you excited for the fans to come here from different countries? I think like um, Sao Paulo have a lot of places to go out in the night. When you go somewhere here, you know, ah, I'm gonna see this one and this one. Yeah, like, yeah. Oh, hello again. <laughs> and in the World Cup, it's gonna be different. What football team do you support? Corinthians. Corinthians. Okay. Right. But here in Sao Paulo, of course. Okay. There you go. Flip flop tap. Okay, so they've just finished training. Athletes, gods, football players. Hi. Hello. <laughs> there you go, nice little salute there. 
Right, so I didn't manage to play on the pitch or get to really speak to them properly, but I'm going to try my hardest and get a selfie with Pato. Fingers crossed. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you, bye. bye. That was amazing. I got into Sao Paulo training ground. Beautiful place. Got a selfie with Pato. Could my day get any better? So I've come out in Sao Paulo to check out the nightlife and it is absolutely stunning. There's bars everywhere and every single bar is playing football. I'm in Villa Madalena and it's kind of like the swanky part. There's football all over the place, beautiful people, lovely food and the best drinks available. Mental. Where in England do you know that they have people at the bar in referee tops? Truth. Any Norwich fans out there, you're being represented in Brazil. How mad is that? What is the history of this bar? Like, where did it start and where did it come from? The way when it starts, you buy a ball to play football. The day of the Brazilian football. So what is this street going to be like when the World Cup's on? It will be a carnival, in another era, especially if Brazil começar a chegar nas finais e ser campeão. Ok, so there's loads and loads of flags in here. You've got a million different teams. Where's the Bristol Rovers flag? Então vocês podem trazer que a gente coloca com outro prazer aqui, alguma coisa, alguma lembrança do time de coração de vocês. Pode trazer, a gente recebe com todo prazer. Voila! Are Sao Paulo fans the most passionate in Brazil, do you think? When you're talking about fans, Corinthians fans are the biggest. Of maybe in Brazil they are the bigger and maybe in the world. Are you going to be here for the World Cup? Yes, I am. Everybody is going to the street to watch and party, yeah. of course. Are you going to be dancing in the parties? Yes, I will. Yeah, shaking your legs, shaking your fluff. Shaking my fluffs and <laughs> waiting for the girls and you no, are girls. Yeah. London girls, come to Brazil. It's going to be massive. I'm excited. I'm going to be here. Can I come and party with you? Yes, you stay in my house. I'll oh, stay in your house? Yes, please. Exactly. Are you joining in? in Sao Paulo during the World Cup, check out my recommendations. Next stop, Curitiba. Tweet me your recommendations at Myodrama, hashtag Hyundai World Cup Cities and keep following my journey on the Hyundai UK Facebook page. And remember, subscribe to Pop and Ivy. Still one this time, we'll see who takes it next time.